now they've left, we want to talk about the things that lived. Not husbands or elbows, oh no, but cranes. The hoisting tackle you're looking at now is only one of the many types. Compare the busy derricks of the quayside to the tapering network of steel that's used in connection with modern building construction, the mighty monotar. But let's go back to the beginning. Probably the crane's predecessor was a crude derrick with a tree and a rope of plaited vines or creepers. Another simple derrick used in wartime is a rigid pole held up by guy ropes and altering the rope swings the pole. A simple hoist consists of two spars joined together at the top to form what is known as sheer legs. The mechanical derrick on our busy walls hoists anything from fish to scaffold poles. And now by courtesy of the Kensington Science Museum Let's examine some of the old types, like this model of a crane of 1729. It was built for lifting quarried stone, the load being raised or lowered by means of a hand winch. With Perronet's crane of 1751, the load was lifted by animals working a treadmill. A great stride was made in 1885 with the invention of a crane with an automatic balance. To counterbalance the load, the increasing tension on the lifting rope pulled a weight on wheels along an inclined arm. A combined crane and locomotive. The arm has three hooks for lifting two, three or four tons at a distance of from 12 to 20 feet. One of the first hydraulic cranes, the lifting and shifting of loads controlled by slide valves worked by hand levers. Cranes of this type were erected at Newcastle in 1846. Balanced lever type of 1928 with a jib made in two parts so that the load, when the main arm is pulled inwards, remains at the same height all the time. A model of the ingenious crane at Grangemouth for loading coal direct from the truck to the collier. A 10 ton truck runs onto a cradle, hooks catch against the front axle, and the hole is lowered and tipped into the hole. Looks like crane again. Yes, it's another view of the Monotar, the most modern crane of all. And now, 